Hello, you beautiful people. Me again. <laughs> Another beautiful day. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Look. You know, Microsoft don't focus on sales, right? <laughs> and, um, you know, they offer services, right? And they make, they make their money that way. But what if I told you in 20 years, Microsoft has never made, a, made any money on their Xboxes? And all the Xbox that Microsoft has made, they have never made profit off one of them. Hmm. Listen to this. You're 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 like you're you're, you're 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 like huh? Listen to this. It says here, Microsoft says Xbox consoles have always been sold at a loss. It says here, it's well known for a fact that when a new gener new game console launch. It's typical to sold at a loss, but as hardware revisions and mass production ramps up, costs fall and consoles should eventually become profitable. However, that's never happened for an Xbox console according to Microsoft. As protocol reports, <clears throat> as business development VP Lori writes, is a third party witness in the Epic vs. Apple trial. Epic lawyer Wes Earnhardt asks Wright, how much margin does Microsoft earn when selling Xbox consoles? To which Wright will respond, we don't. We sell the console as at a loss. As VGC points out, Wright was also asked if there has ever been a profit generated from an Xbox console sale, which she confirmed has never happened. To put that in, in context, Microsoft has been selling Xbox since selling Xbox for nearly 20 years now, yep. including the original Xbox, the 360, Xbox One, and now the Xbox Series X and S. In all that time, every single console sale costs Microsoft money. Hmm. The reason game consoles end up being profitable is through a combination of software, service, and accessory sales, but, it, but it's still surprising to find Microsoft has never achieved hardware profit profitability and an analyst Daniel Ahmad confirmed that the PS4 eventually became profitable for Sony and that Nintendo developed the switch to be profitable quickly so Microsoft is the odd one out <laughs> breaking that trend with the Xbox Series X or S Series S seems unlikely not only due to the expensive component it relies on but because of the ongoing shortage of components worldwide, costs are not going to fall quickly and demands for hardware remains high to the point where Microsoft can't reproduce them fast enough. <laughs> and that's the end of the article. Somebody said in the comment, uh, somebody said in the comment, he said, and I am supposed to believe that when Microsoft has done nothing out of the goodness of their corp, corp, corporatist art. Can you imagine Bill Gates or Steve Ballmer allowing something like no profit? Instead of we don't, <laughs> we sell the console at a loss. I think a more honest answer would be, I'm, a more honest, more honest answer would have been, I am taking you for a, for a fool and, sh and shouting that in your face. <laughs> <laughs> uh, another person response you're hilarious hilarious to think that making 10 50 dollar console would ever be worth it for anyone of course they sell it at a loss in order to lock people into their ecosystem and it says wow talk about a fool shouting in your ears corporation don't exist to do anything out of the goodness of their hearts they only exist to solve problems people are willing to spend money on, bored and want to play video games with your friends. Microsoft has a solution for you. Don't like it? Don't buy their console. Like Mike said, selling their console at a loss is done to compel cons customers to buy other high margin items. Why the skepticism? skepticism? <laughs> anyway, this article boils down to uh, Microsoft uh, 
Microsoft sell Xboxes at a loss. Me, I think Xboxes are. T Here's what I think. M me, I'm thinking Xbox is just a tax write-off. That's why they, they probably settled at a loss. Microsoft got their, it's like a spider. They got their hands in so in so many things. And they got so many income coming in. It's like, okay, we'll, we'll sell this console at a loss, but we'll provide a service so, so it can benefit the entire Xbox ecosystem. And me being an Xbox user will tell you, I love it. <laughs> I'll, I'll take a powerful... I will take a powerful console any day because I know I'm getting the best out of gaming when I get that console. If I'm getting a weak console, I'm not satisfied. Okay? So I would rather buy the Xbox, I would rather get the Xbox Series X and enjoy the services that it has. You know what I'm saying? That way I can get my the, to get the best gaming experience versus having a weak console and doing and, and not getting anything. So what my, what Microsoft provide with Xbox is a uh, is a service, but the service is really good, and um, they're taking gaming seriously. And if they're not, I mean, I, you know, I was thinking that I remember the first, like when they first came out with the Xbox Xbox Series X, they had like a, a, a mini Xbox Series X. <laughs> Maybe Microsoft should have went with that one instead, <laughs> and I like cut the Xbox Series X in half and make a mini version of it, and that way they can make a, make some money off of it. But based on what they're doing right now with Xbox, um, uh, they're, 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 they're fine, you know. They're fine, you know. And um, the services that they provide and the deals that they have, and plus with the Game Pass, Xbox Live, you know, X Cloud, they're making their money. They're making their money back, you know. So, you know, you, you know, you, you know, you got to give up something to get something, you know. So for Microsoft right now, they're they're, they're doing pretty fine, and. Um, what uh, that Game Pass is no, it, 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 it's like it's like to me Game Pass is like a big bail bond, bail bondsman. <laughs> you know, it, it's doing a, it's doing good for the Microsoft uh, community. So, and plus, not only that, iOS users get to play Xbox games, uh, and um, uh, PC players get to play Xbox games. So, Microsoft is doing fine. You know, I mean, I mean. They they, 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 they they got their hands in, in so many things, man. So, I mean, they take a loss. They got they take a loss, but they find other ways to make the money back. So, Xbox Xbox is good, man. And I'm glad I got one. But anyway, I'm going to leave a link in the description box with this article. Nice talking to you people again. Chris, it's still a Star Wars and Star Trek thing. Or Dark Side. Come on. Peace. <clears throat>